Yeah, we are on. We are on a good fish here. There's birds and that everywhere. But we have been struggling. Um, they've just not been easy to catch. But this, oh, this is this is an okay fish. Better go easy on them. He liked um, he liked the the quick movement. I might be chasing him down your way in a minute. Oh no, no he's all right. Oh, hopefully it's a tree or something. It's 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 quite solid. This could be a tree. I'm going to call a tree. Sort of. Um, a little bit too solid for a car why? Oh, I don't watch these birds on the line. You'd think with all these birds it'd be easy to hook up, but it hasn't been. Well the well the birds are easy to hook up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it's pulling a bit of string here. Button off some more just in case it is a big tree. Hopefully, it is a tree, not a car one. Could be the one we need, uh, we needed to um, boost the morale. Fishing's been difficult with this wind, and we just had a bird. Which, uh, oh, there's still plenty of line on that, but it took a lot of that spot. <laughs> oh, this one's putting up a scrap anyway. Because look at you. It feels like he's got plenty of energy anyway. Scrap here. Oh shit, what was that? Oh, bird at the <laughs> bird at the top of the rod. <laughs> oh, it's chaos. Come on. Yeah, I'm gonna say tree, hey, this is a scrap. Had to be something good and all that lot, eh? He's decent. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say Trev. Oh, there he is. There's something there. See color. What are you? What are you? It's big. Whatever it is. Oh, be a big Trev. Good, you can see my house from where we are. This is a nice fish too. Holy shit, that's big, hey? He's almost 10 pounds, I'd say. Oh, stay on there. We need you, we need to boost the morale. Oh shit, where do you wanna go? There you go. Oh, he's nice, man. A nice fish. Yeah, buddy. Cheers, man, he's over 10 pounds. Holy hell! That's a fucking doozy. That's a beast, man! That was a good scrap, too. Yeah! Holy hell! Hoo hoo! <laughs> what would that be? That would be almost 15, wouldn't it? 15 pound? That's, that's pretty heavy. That hook just fell out. 
Oh, that, that's just oh. made a little mission all the, all the while. You. 60, 60, 64 centimeters. Woohoo! That is a nice fish. Woo! What a beauty. Well, we've ducked out today. Really know what I was going to get up to today, and uh, I rang Dan for some divine inspiration. <laughs> and Dan, Dan's had some hard luck. Um, boat's broken down, <laughs> and the dogs have got the go slow. Hey, what? Which is uh, it's just in the North Island, eh? Yeah, yeah. So, what is it that's from the pigs, eh? Toxin from the pigs. Yeah. From the pigs' blood. So, so I run down to, to cheer me up. Look at that, he's been the hook. Holy hell, that's lucky. Oh my god. That's that was really lucky. There you go, that was probably I've probably used that too many times. Oh yeah. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Hooked up again after missing two huge ones. This one feels right. Oh, he's right there. He's a snapper, he's good. Hey, just when we got back in the line of those um, birds. Jim. for the week Sunday Sunday afternoon not the nicest weather but who cares when you're getting fish like that oh that's a good tree man oh hell he's a big bad boy oh yeah Front if you want there, are you right? <laughs> oh, we're real close to the boat ramp now. This is a good fish. You gotta chase him around there. Nice, nice. Oh, this is what you need to chew you up, mate. <laughs> yeah. Nice snapper. He's more. Oh, he's an eating kind of size, isn't he? Shut up. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Are you good? Change Dan up here, he's got the slow, oh, what is that called, a jitterbug? Because we've gone a bit deeper chasing these birds. These looks all right. I'm going at quite a big catch lure, so I'm, I'm after a kingy. That's at least you know that's working, eh? Yeah. And straight away. Nothing's hit this catch. No birds. This catch on yet. I've thrown it out a couple of times. Quite a big lure. Need a decent fish for this one. Trying to go around that other side. It's giving me a bit of trouble. Oh yeah. Mm, okay. He's alright, that's a nice fish. Oh, oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Oh, he's still there. Yeah, that's good. This might be, this might be a, a decent fish. This is, um, yeah, that's quite a, quite a, a bigger lure for what we've been using. This is, this is good. This is on my, uh, on my twin powers. It's quite a, um, it's a bit of a no-name rod. My mate hooked me up. Oh, stay on there. Um, I broke one. He just gave me this to, uh, 
friend Dave at the tackle shop gave me this till I got another one it's, it really suits this little trim powers it's quite stiff oh, if we can keep this this is a, this is a decent fish anyway I'm in for a scrap here woohoo you it's a truck uh, um yeah. I wonder if we get this I don't know what I've got here, but it's it's good. It's good. I'm going to be on this one. I'll stay on there. On the boat, <laughs> got like a it's quite a large catch penny drop. This, but um, I think the hooks on this are a reasonably heavy gauge. So, Oop. um, this is good. This is good. He's doing laps around the boat. Oh, well, I couldn't tell you what this is yet. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say a little ratty just because a little rat king because I know they, they would like I imagine they would like that lure. But, uh, very hard to say, very hard to say. This is great workout fishing though, there's all sorts in here. I've sort of been hooked up to a few quite heavy fish and um just they've just been popping off just a bit unlucky really, but uh, this one, this one at the moment. Give me some, give me a decent scrap. What's your call? What's your call down? What do you reckon? Yeah, he's definitely, um, he's doing laps. He's doing laps. He can't be true. Oh, shit. Um, I might have to come. Yeah, cheers, bud. Yeah, I'm gonna have to come right around. That's, that's, uh, we're going for lap two. Woo -hoo -hoo. Hey, little beauty, I love, I love like, light gear. I love catching big fish on light gear. I suppose, oh, oh yeah, nice. Nice, nice. Double hookups. Oh, oh, oh. This is a, this is the first for today, isn't it? Just have to be careful with those little hooks on there. Oh, what a scrap! This is awesome. Oh, I can look at this one. Don't you tangle on that other fish? Jeez! <laughs> Come on, let's have a look at you. You got another nice snapper. Huh? I'm coming. I'm coming around. For, I'm doing the full round here. This guy. This guy is a is a bit like he's not going to be easy to land. This is the second time round. Hard to do this and keep the pressure on. Oh, there he goes. Yes, stay on, buddy. Woo! -hoo. <laughs> this is a scrap and a half. Yeah, this is uh, so this little twin powers I've been leaving on this setup because it's a little bit stiffer, um, and this has just got a little bit more. There he is, there he is. That's another trev, it's another big trev. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> God, that's another one over 60 centimeters. He's so fat. Holy Toledo. Oh my God. <laughs> oh shit. That's uh, a little catch lure. 
he is, he's just as, just as big as that last one. Oh my god. That will get that too. I'll smoke that one. Yeah. He's another one, he's about the same, 60 odd centimetres. Oh, he's 70 centimetres, that one. 70 centimetres. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. That's another good fish. Oh, oh, oh. Go, you good thing. Oh, wow. Wow, I wonder what this one is. He's nice though, Jesus, some fish in this river. He's struggling to chase these guys down, but it's, it's kind of worth it. Oh, hopefully we've got something uh, different this time. He's, he's, dude, he's being a little bit different to those trees. Not that I have any problem with those trees, but he doesn't feel like a trees. He's feeling like a snapper. And a good one. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. I've just about given up on that drift, but... Hey, like they always say, the snapper are just hanging back. Hey, this is where the snapper are hanging. I'm gonna say it's a snapper, I'm assuming. It's not doing, uh, it's not racing me round and round the boat anyway. Like those trips. He's taking a bit of line. Oh, this is great for the backyard. Go to the backyard. <laughs> Big fish. Oh, keep leaving the GoPro on today. So the, we've lost one battery, but I've got another one. It's good. So that was all that just come up. He is really nice. Did he go 15? He'd be around 15. That little catch lure. Lovely. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Very sharp hook. <laughs> you just grab that for a sec. That's for a still too. Thank you, boy. Oh, well, next cast. And it's off. It's off again. This catch lure is deadly in the workups. And it's another snapper. So our workups up there. Um wasn't actually very hopeful this morning, so I didn't do an intro or anything. We just kind of what's happened was I just happened to ring Dan. I didn't know what I was gonna do with the day being a Sunday. And this guy is hunting, he hunts, he's hunting or fishing or something, but his dogs are out of action, his boat's out of action, so... So we've come and, um, yeah, just come out for a, for a couple of beers and in the hope of finding a workup and we've found one, alright? <laughs> and this is just awesome fishing. I mean, those Trevally are, are uh, a serious, serious battle. Um, and now we're hitting the snapper, we're just on the tail end of it now, so everything that's getting smashed on top will be drifting back here, so... Um, we're knocking over these snappers, this is, this is great fishing. Well, this catch lure is my new favourite workup lure. It must be... It must be getting uh, similar to what they're eating down there. Nice. Ew. There you go Liam, that's how I do it. I'll just put it in the rod holder and grab this other rod. <laughs> oh shivers. I'm still having trouble finding your Matt Watson episode. 
apparently it's the funniest Matt Watson uh, show episode ever. Uh, with you boys on it, so um, you'll have to tell me how I can find that. What what the uh, what episode it is, so I can check it out. You definitely got to come up and bring that kayak. He's just a baby. That was a good hit. Smashed it on the way down. Let's see what this one is. Absolutely smashed that. Feeling a bit like a snapper too. He was way up, way up in the water. It's just a little break-off group from the uh, the big bunch is actually headed to the beach, and there's a little break-off group. There's there's still fish in that just just to the left of us. And, uh, yeah, this is uh, exceptional fishing. Beautiful Doubtless Bay at its best. So, um, the head shakes, it's doing the head shakes. It's, uh, it's a good fish. It's definitely feeling like a snapper. Soft bait, soft baits out there as well. I'll try that same trick. Oh, oh, yeah, go, go, go. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> He's almost around the door. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Get him, get him, get him, get him. It's big, it's big. Yeah. Oh, yeah, go, 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 go. Get that one. Woohoo. Can you get it? It's not a string. I'm seeing him. What's that one like? Rods everywhere. I'll get that out of your way. Oh, come on. oh my god. You! <laughs> That's gonna fucking take your mind off things, isn't it, Dan? Uh, this is what we we're after. This is what we needed, just get rid of that. Oh, pretty full on week. You've been going hard at work, Dan. As a I've got to say it, Danny, you're a bit of a workaholic. <laughs> and now your boat's not bloody uh, in the water, you must be... You must be hanging for something like this. What was actually wrong with it? No, I think a seal went right at the bottom of the engine. Oh. Danny's got a beautiful... Uh, Start the spark plug and work your way down. Oh, yeah. Um, do you want me to take that at the back? That rod? Yeah, I'll get that out of your way, eh? Stay on there, fish! Oh, is that the swirl from mine? Mine's up, is he? So, um... Oh, yeah, he's nice. He's nice. Um, so they're feeding off... These big snapper are feeding right at the surface with... Those trevally and everything else. Oh, these are lovely fish. He's sort of at 10 pound. Oh, probably eight. Eight or nine, that one. Solid snapper, anyway. Oh, yes. How are you looking there? Give me a sec. I'll get this net free. This little catch lure is. I'm really enjoying fishing this. Um, I'm sort of speed jigging it um, for a few pumps. And then. Um, Letting it drop and but that one I mean that just that just only just hit the surface and he was off. Another very nice fish. You and another one. Ah, oh, too good. Too much fun. Too much fun. Just a little soft weight. This session is, is turned pretty epic. We've got a nice bin full to eat for our two families. 
And we're just, we're just having a bloody laugh now. Look at that, Phew. Nice one. Oh, 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 this one's got one now. <laughs> oh, the old switcheroo on the soft bait. Hey, this is nice, it's really very soft rod, a little uh, epic grass there. Someone had thrown away. Put it in my decor decorative uh, net that I've got on my fence. <laughs> I just it was just missing an eye, so it's, uh, it's my spear. My backup. And it's working, it's working. This one's only a little one. You can go back and get bigger. Ew. That was the next drop, I just let it out and this has got smashed again. We're, we're, we're caught away from the birds now, but uh, yeah, obviously the snapper hanging out. Well, I, I assume this is a snapper, but uh, man, they smashed it. Oh, come on, stay on. Man, this is just turning into a bit of a session, all right? Just a sneaky, uh, quick fish, Sunday, Sunday Arvo fish. Definitely, um, definitely think we've found quite a good, uh, work up, work up jig here. We were just talking about the hooks on it, it's really strong and, um, and really super sharp. So. It's a nice, uh, nice jig. Everything seems to, uh, yeah, it goes, the weight of it goes really well with this rod. This is not a, a, a soft, soft bait rod at all. It's, it's a stiff, it's not, it's got a no brand on it at all. I couldn't tell you what it is, Fuji Guides. Lovely little thing. And, um, oh, another little absolutely burnt snapper. Mr. Snapper. You. The other uh, soft baiting guy that watches that, Mark Catteridge, hey, he knows a thing or two. He was, um, he was selling me all my, uh, my fishing gear back, back when I was just a young fella. Um, when he was in the shop at uh, Newmarket, uh, just fishing. With uh, Justin, I uh, can't remember his name, but yeah, a couple of a couple of heavyweights in the fishing. But yeah, Mark's definitely um, a good. Oh, oh, is it a hit? Good soft bait. But, um, yeah, I watched that Sea Money Fish guy. He'll catch. He'll catch fish in canals, little little waterways on the side of the road. He'll be waiting for a ferry, and it, and he'll get on ten different species. Um, it's, it's actually really. You know, it's subtle, it's not a full-on show, it's just a guy like me just fishing, but um, his technique is flawless. Um, I think we're just lucky up here with the amount of fish we've got. <laughs> I think it's a test. <laughs> Nothing to do with uh, uh, my style at all. It's, um, it wouldn't be too far off the Bay of Plenty, I know that place is um, a great place to fish. So with this one, I'm just kind of almost a slow, well, slow for a speed jig for a kingy, and then um, I'm just coming up five, ten meters, and then letting it sink back down. So, when we were on the fish, they were just smashing it on the drop. Can't actually see where that workup's gone now, can you? Oh yeah, there it is. It's heading, it's heading the way we've got to go, so that's kind of handy <laughs> to go back. I'll turn this off and I'll hook up. Look, look at this guy. He's stolen a soft bait rod, and he is just hooked up on probably the best fish of the day. This one just took off like a the mad truck. <laughs> um, what have I got on there? I've got that little soft bait hook. So, um, you, you enjoy the ride, because <laughs> I think you're good out here. 
<laughs> About time you picked up for something. <laughs> a quiet guy. What do you got, man? That's big, eh? Oh, shit. There goes more. Double hookups, double hookups again. It's this one. Nothing like your one. Awesome, awesome fishing. Um, this this little rod that I put on my fixed uh, whoever's this rod is, it's probably yours, Goldie, if you're watching. I think this might be your old rod. It's still catching fish. I hooked it up with a sustain 5000, which uh, which I normally have on a little top water um, rig, but they that gold is uh, soft baiting reels as well. I mean, really nice. Beautiful things to use. You are locked in on something good there, mate. Good on you. Good on you. Come here. Come here. Another nice one. This, this, this is um, this is actually a, quite a serious fish. Dan's on here. I'm gonna keep my lines out. I want to see this one. We don't want to get in the way. I'm gonna actually sit back and crack a beer because this this is the kind of TV I like. <laughs> watching, watching the boys hooked up on oh, massive fish. This could be. This could be the one you've been chasing around the North Cape. <laughs> if you get this in the backyard, I'm going to crack up because I reckon this is a big one. This, this will be your... Uh, have you cracked a 20 on your soft bait? Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, okay. Far those first couple of runs though, jeez. Oh, there it is there. Oh, damn, I just cracked my beer. Mate, this is a big, he could be 20, bro. He could be 20. Oh, nah, nah. Nah, you made it look good for the camera, though. Mate, he's only 10 pounds. Nah, <laughs> nah he's, he'd, he'd, be, he'd be close to 15, I think. The, uh, my, my little favourite, the old nuclear pilchard. I'll, I'll give you the release, eh? Just to hold him up. I'll try and hold him up. He's a good fish, mate. Well done. Fish of the snapper of the day, mate. Nice fish. You! That's not bad for the backyard right there. Some fish here. Hey, do you know if the scholar boats are out? Do you know if the scholar boats are out? They're not out, or you don't know? Oh, yeah, normally they're over there. They're really good to fish behind. <laughs> I just don't know when they start up. But, uh, nah, the fishing's bloody exceptional. Sorry? No, no, I've just been chasing workouts. But we're, get, we're getting um, these trevs that are like 15, 16 pound. Uh, they're moving pretty quick, the workouts, but yeah, the snapper was the biggest snapper, probably probably 17 pound or something, I don't know. Heaps of fish have just been releasing them, there's tons. That's good. You'll do well. I'll catch you soon, eh? Uh, he actually smokes, uh, I don't know what sort of quota he's got or how, how it works, but um, yeah, the, the young man we were just talking to in the valley at the little um, longliner over there, he owns a business called Apotu Apoa, which is 
um, a smokehouse. He does beautiful smoked fish in packages. You've probably seen it in the shops. Yeah. Everywhere, it's all it's all over the country. And um, but the cool thing about that guy, if you're not from around here, is he can take your fish and he'll smoke it for you while you're up on holiday. And he does uh, he does a really good job. Uh, he'll he'll do your own, your fish as well as all the fish he's catching. So. Um, uh, yeah, a poti Power and it's in Monganui. I, I forgot his name. That's why I didn't. Uh, <laughs> I didn't carry on <laughs> with um, chatting to him. So I couldn't. I couldn't bloody remember his name. But it'll come to me. But yeah, uh, good good guy. And uh, he'll smoke your fish if you get a bit kingy or whatever while you're on holiday in the far north. Um, yeah. So keep an eye out for his his stuff. A very 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 good smoker. Very heavy smoker. Well, there we go. Those are heavy dogs. Luckies. <laughs> Another beautiful day in the far north. So I'm sure you've all heard the story about uh, Lucky the cat. One eyed, one arm. I don't know, you've all, it comes to the name of Lucky. Everyone's heard about it. Well, we've got a dog called Lucky here. Look at this thing. It's, it survived Parvo. It flew out of a truck, 100 kilometers an hour, and got lost for three days. And who found it? Yes, who found it? Some kids. So this is Dan's new hunting dog. Look at this thing go. <laughs> it's 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 an absolute survivor. This thing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't choke on that thing. Yeah. <laughs> hey, lucky! It's your lucky day, lucky. Don't forget to chew that tail. <laughs> yeah. So you got a couple of new dogs. How long does it take to train a dog like that? Uh, young ones. Yeah. Um, usually start them when they're about twelve months old and. And they're usually hopefully doing their job or sign their two. Yeah. Well, Lucky's got the biggest feet out of any dog I've ever seen. Well, you might not like a bit of fish too, Zenny Beans. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> Look at these trevs. Jesus, dog. Don't forget to chew. Look at these trevs, Zenny Beans. So, um. Man, that's, that's a big one, that one, eh? Far out, they're fat. Yeah, that one's way bigger. Ah, uh, uh, no, they're not giant trevally, but they're big trevally. <laughs> I think um, giant trevally get like 70 kilos or something, don't they? Yeah, 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 but we don't get them here. But the way the temperature's <laughs> coming... <laughs> Hey, global warming, we're getting wahoo and stuff every so often. A <laughs> couple more years maybe we'll be into them, eh? 